A few days ago, the Father instructed me to begin to pray and to share the prayers on YouTube. I had various doubts and conflicts about doing this. I've shared some things which have been more autobiographical than I might have wanted to, but I wanted to do it for edification purposes. But praying seems like such an intimate heart-to-heart -heart meeting with the Most High Yahua. And I didn't know why the Father really wanted me to do it. I thought it seemed like a good idea, but I had those reservations. I also said to myself, well, no one will listen to this. He told me that he didn't ask me to guarantee the outcome. He told me what he wanted me to do. And while I dithered about praying, one of our sisters began to post a series of prayers on YouTube. And the father almost looked me in the eye, I say this metaphorically, and said, I told you to do this, and you delayed, and therefore I raised up someone else who would do it, who would be obedient to my commandment. So I come before the Father and I repent. I repent in sackcloth and ashes. I repent and I ask you, Abba Yahuwah, that you would please forgive your servant. I do want to obey you. I don't want to be a Saul who had to be reminded that obedience is better than sacrifice, that rebellion is as the sin of witchcraft. So right now, I say, Father, thank you. I praise you. I worship you. I magnify you. I revere you. You are the Holy One of Yashar El. You are the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. You are the strong tower of your people. You are the fortress for your children. You are the strength of Israel. You are our shield and our exceeding great reward. Father, in the name of your son, Yahushua HaMashiach, I come before you and I say thank you, Father. I thank you, Father, for awakening your children today. I thank you, Father, for keeping us in a reasonable portion of health and strength. I thank you, Heavenly Father, that we are able to hear your voice and to respond to you and for giving us another opportunity to be obedient and to get it right. Heavenly Father, in the name of your Son, Yahushua HaMashiach, I lift up my hands before you and I declare that you are the Holy One of Israel. I declare, Heavenly Father, that you are the one who sits high, but you look low. I thank you, Heavenly Father, that you gave us your word in the Holy Scriptures, from Genesis to Revelation, and all of the words that the brothers and the sisters have authored over the centuries and the millennia. Father, I thank you for Abraham, for Isaac, and for Yaakov. I thank you, Heavenly Father, that they obeyed your voice, they hearkened unto your voice, and they followed after you. I thank you, Heavenly Father, that you opened their eyes to see who you were, and you chose them as your people, your special inheritance. I ask, Heavenly Father, that you would look upon the descendants of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob today, and that you would cause your people to awaken to who they are. That we would not awaken, Heavenly Father, to pride in our identity, but that we would remember, Father, that you broke us off from the tree of Yahusha HaMashiach. That you, Heavenly Father, rebuked us for our unrighteousness and uncleanness and ungodliness, Heavenly Father. Our forefathers did that which was not right in your eyes, and we worshiped idols under every green tree. Father, we bowed down and did that which was not meat. We were the chosen people. We were the bride, Heavenly Father. We were your bride, your son's bride, Heavenly Father. 
And instead, we went whoring after other gods. Father, we didn't even have to do it for pay. We did it for free. We were vile. And when you sent your children, the prophets rising early and sending them to rebuke us and to call us back to the love that you had for us, Heavenly Father, we refused and we killed those prophets. And finally, we killed your son, Yahushua HaMashiach. O Abba Yahuwah. You spoke in time past unto the fathers by the prophets, but in these last days, you have spoken unto us by your son, Yahushua HaMashiach, by whom you created the world. He is the word, the word that was with you and the word that is you. All things were made by your son, Yahushua, and without him was not anything made that was made. Father, I pray that you would please look upon your people and pardon us. We have done grievously against you, Abba Yahua. We have failed you in what we have done. We have served other gods. And even now, Father, not just our forefathers, but we ourselves, Father, bow down to the unclean and to the ungodly with all that we watch and with all that we listen to and with all with whom we fellowship, Father. We are not concerned about your glory and your honor and your majesty. We do not delight ourselves in you, Abba Yahua, for there is no people like Israel whom you have called. You took Israel as your own bride. And Father, we played the field and did that which was unclean and evil and served these other gods. We served entertainment, Father. We served mammon, Father. We served Buddha, Father. We served Allah, Father. We served the, the wicked things and spirits of Judaism, Father. We served Roman Catholicism and its gods and its many, many saints, Father. We served the gods of Protestantism, Father. Father, we know that those Those religions do not follow hard after you, Father. We know, Heavenly Father, that Hinduism, they do not worship the Elohim of Abraham, Isaac, and Yaakov. Father, we need you to open our eyes and turn us back. Turn us back from the vomit of our false religions and our idols. Help us to put away our idols as your servant John taught us. He called us little children and he told us to keep ourselves from idols. But we would not do it, Father. We would not keep ourselves from idols. We did that which was unspeakable and abominable and ugly and vile in your sight. And you put up with us and put up with us and put up with us until you finally fulfilled your word and loaded us up on slave ships and scattered us abroad, Father. You destroyed our ancient city of Jerusalem, Father. And you sent us scattering around the world, Heavenly Father. Father, we did that which was wrong. We did that, Father. You were righteous and just and holy, Father, in fulfilling your word. And you punished us less than our sins deserved, Father. In that you preserved unto yourself this day a remnant. Father, we pray that you would open the eyes of the remnant. Open the ears of the remnant. Cause us to seek you with all of our heart, soul, mind, and strength, Heavenly Father. Cause us, Father, to turn away from all things that are not of you, that are not like you, and that lead us away from you, Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father, in the name of your son, Yahushua HaMashiach, I pray that you would please, Heavenly Father, help us, Father, to put away anything, Father, that detracts from your glory. Help us not to bring any false power into your face, Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father, I pray that you would give us hearts of repentance that you would give us the grace of supplication, Father, that we would turn to you in tears, broken over our sin and our forefathers' sins, Heavenly Father. I pray that you would cleanse us, Heavenly Father, that you would forgive our ancestors, Father, that you would forgive our forefathers, Father, here and in all the places to which we have been scattered, Heavenly Father. Father, we did not know you, We did not know you and we did not serve you. We refused to serve you, but we served the gods of those who took us captive, Heavenly Father. Forgive us, Father. Forgive us of our wrong and forgive us of our sin, Father. Forgive us of the hatred in our heart, Father, and the contention that we contend with you continually, Heavenly Father. 
Help us, Heavenly Father, to obey your voice speaking through your Son. Move by your Ruach HaKadosh to give us new eyes and new hearts, Heavenly Father. And do as you promised in Jeremiah, Father, when you promised, Father, to write your laws upon our hearts, Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father, I pray that your kingdom would come and that your will would be done, Heavenly Father. Gather your people because we have done foolishly, but you promised that you would gather a remnant, Father. You promised in Isaiah, Father, that yet a tenth would be saved and returned into the land. So, Father, Abba Yahuwah Elohim, please gather your people this day, Father. Gather us out of our darkness, Heavenly Father, and bring us into your marvelous light, Heavenly Father. Help us to immerse ourselves in your word, Heavenly Father. Help us to return to the covenant, Heavenly Father. Back to the statutes, Father, that your servant Moses set out, Heavenly Father. Help us to remember our ways, Heavenly Father, to think, Father, upon the things that we have done heavenly father and make us hungry and thirsty for you that the rivers of living water would flow out of our bellies heavenly father the way your son Yahushua Hamashiach taught it heavenly father I pray that you would do a new work for your people heavenly father I pray that you would forgive your people heavenly father I pray that you would gather us together heavenly father I pray that you would shake us up out of our heathen pagan darknesses heavenly father I pray anything father that keeps us from you father that you would thrust it away from us, Heavenly Father. If it's money and cars and houses, Heavenly Father, that keep us from knowing you, Heavenly Father, I pray that you would take them away from us, Heavenly Father, that we might know you and walk with you, Father, in spirit and in truth, Heavenly Father, through your son, Yahushua Hamashiach. Oh, Father, you are the bright and the morning star, and we thank you, Father. We know, Father, in the temple that you and your son are the light of it, Father. There will be no need for a sun or a moon, Heavenly Father. You and the Lamb are the light of it, Heavenly Father. Abba Yahuwah, we delight in you because you chose us from before the foundations of the world, Heavenly Father. And we pray that you would bring in all your children, Father, all of your children from the 12 tribes, Heavenly Father, and those whom you desire to adopt and even from the other nations, Heavenly Father. We pray that your kingdom would come and that your will would be done, Heavenly Father. Abba Yahuwah, we give you glory and we give you honor and we ask that you would pardon us of our sins, Heavenly Father. There are things within us, Heavenly Father, which we need to put away, Heavenly Father. There are uncleannesses, Heavenly Father, and disobediences, Heavenly Father. And we need you, Heavenly Father, now more than we have ever needed you before, Heavenly Father. Open the eyes of our understanding that we may know the glory of your inheritance in us, Heavenly Father. Help us, Heavenly Father, not to let any Anything separate us from the love of Yahuwah in Yahusha Habashiach, Heavenly Father. Oh, Father. You are our shield and our exceeding great reward. You are our joy. You are our strength. You are the living bread. You are the bread of life. You, Heavenly Father, through your Son, you are the shepherd, the great shepherd of the sheep, Heavenly Father. And we pray, Heavenly Father, right now that you would do a new and a glorious work, Father, starting right now, Heavenly Father. Deliver your children today, Heavenly Father. Deliver Israel out of the bondage and captivity of our captors, Heavenly Father. Those who deny that we're even in captivity, Father. Those who gaslight us, Heavenly Father. Those who have afflicted us grievously, Heavenly Father. Because you promised, Heavenly Father, that after 400 years, Heavenly Father, you would afflict the nation that afflicted us, Heavenly Father. And you would send us out with great substance, Heavenly Father. So please send us out with that substance, Father. Please give us a treasure that you have promised us, Heavenly Father. Please give us a renewed and strengthened faith in you, Heavenly Father. Please, Father, let us not look to these companies and look to these jobs, Heavenly Father. Let us not look to our medicines and let us not look to our foods and let us not look to our homes, Heavenly Father. Let us not look to anything that we have in the flesh, Father, but let us look to you and you alone, Heavenly Father. All provision comes from you, Heavenly Father. We thank you and we praise you, Father. There is none like you, Father. You are our joy, Father. You are our exceeding great reward, Heavenly Father. Oh, Father, I just pray right now that you would move according to your own righteousness, Heavenly Father. Move according to the counsel of your own will, Heavenly Father. 
Abba Yahua Elohim, thank you for calling your children. Thank you for adopting us as your people. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for establishing us and re-establishing your people, Father. Establish us, Father. Help us not to be caught up in foolish genealogies and debates, Heavenly Father, but help us to turn to you, to your living word, Heavenly Father. Help us to trust in you, Father, to trust in you alone, Heavenly Father. Oh, Abba Yahuwah, let your will be done and let your kingdom come. Father, we give you the glory and we give you the praise and we give you the honor for there is none like you. You are our shield. You are our defense. You are our strength. You are our wisdom. You are our righteousness, Father. We have no hope, Heavenly Father, of glory and of the kingdom, Heavenly Father, except through your son, Yahusha Hamashiach. Please, Heavenly Father, wash us in the blood of the Lamb, Heavenly Father. Please, Heavenly Father, plant us in the temple where we will no more go out, but be pillars in the house of our Elohim, Heavenly Father. O oh, Abba Yahu, do exceeding abundantly above all that we could ask or think according to the Ruach HaKadosh working in your people, Father. Thank you, Father. We praise you, Father, and we magnify you, Father. In Yahusha's holy and mighty and wondrous name, Heavenly Father, we ask all of these things. And we say, let it be done, Heavenly Father, according to your word, Heavenly Father, according as you have spoken it, Heavenly Father. We say, hallelujah. Thank you, Yahusha. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father.